Hey friends, it's Melanie, and I thought to celebrate my channel reaching 1,000 subscribers, which I'm so like blown away by, that I would do just a fun um, tag. I thought about doing the TMI tag, and those were some really good questions, but um, yeah, I just decided to do this one instead. It's called the 100 questions nobody asks. There are a hundred. I'm going to go as fast as I can. Some of them are really kind of dumb. I won't lie. I read probably 20 out of the hundred. So, um, yeah, this is, I should just title this video a hundred more random things that you may or may not want to know about me. <laughs> and, um, just so that you know, the lighting is not great in this video because of the time of the day it is. Um, I'm filming on my iPad because I need to look at my iPhone so that I can see the questions. So yeah, let's get started. Um, do you sleep with your closet doors open or closed? I always sleep with them closed, not really for any other reason other than I don't like for things to be like unfinished. And to me, an open closet door means it just seems unfinished. Do you take the shampoos and conditioner bottles from the hotel? Only if they're really good, but to be honest with you, now I, okay, I used to a lot more. Now I really don't so much only because the quality of the products there doesn't seem all that great compared to what I use. So, do you sleep with your sheets tucked in or out? As you guys can see, my sheets are out. So yeah, I sleep with them out, I guess. Have you ever stolen a street sign before? No, and that's kind of okay. Do you like to use post-it notes? Oh my gosh, for everything. I use post-it notes every day like for everything. It's it's a little bit of an obsession. Do you cut out coupons but then never use them? Yes, but when I um, cut them or tear them out of something or whatever, I, I usually have the best of intentions of using them and then I have something on me. Distractions. And, um, and then the expiration date comes and goes and I just forget about it. So yeah. Um, would you rather be attacked by a big bear or a swarm of bees? I think I'm, I will pro, I would probably survive being attacked by a swarm of bees. Maybe not so much the bear, but I'm, I might be able to outrun a bear. Maybe not. Ugh, I don't like either one of those options, but we're going to go with bees because I'm possibly more likely to survive that one. Do you have freckles? Yes, I do. I was actually commenting on them the other day. I was showing them to my son. I do have them. Do you always smile for pictures? <sighs> If it's like someone's going to take a picture of me, yes, I smile, but I don't love my smile in pictures. So I try, you know, what is your biggest pet peeve? My kids told me the other day that my biggest pet peeve is people lying to me. I do not like it when people lie, but my second biggest pet peeve is being late. So like for someone else to do to me, it would be lying. But for me personally, I hate being late. I cannot stand it. Do you ever count count your steps when you walk? Yes, and I wasn't aware that anyone else did that. Have you ever been camping? Yes. My family did that a lot when I was growing up. I had an avid hatred for it, um, but now, as long as we're not talking about going camping in the middle of a Texas summer, it's actually really fun. I love it. I love going hiking and just like, go. I, I don't know. I just like camping now. How long has it been since you've been camping? We went camping last year, actually. Last summer, we went for my husband's birthday. We went to um, Beaver's Bend in Oklahoma. So if you know where that is, give, it, give me a thumbs up because it's awesome. Okay. Um, do you ever dance if even if there's no music playing? Nah, not really. But if there's music on, oh yeah, it's hard to keep me still. Okay, do you chew your pens and pencils? No, absolutely not. How many people have you spent time with this week? Actually a lot because I went to my niece and nephew's birthday party yesterday morning. So yeah, I don't, I'm not going to give you an exact number. It was a pretty big birthday party. It was a lot. How many people have I spent time with that were not family? None. <laughs> wow. <laughs> okay. What size is your bed? Queen. But I would love to have a king size bed. What is your song of the week? Um, I think I honestly have to say 
It's kind of an old song, but the song that's been going through my head like on and on and on and on is by Maroon 5 and it's called She Will Be Loved. I love that song. Is it okay for guys to wear pink? Some guys can totally pull it off, some guys not so much. But if you are a guy who can pull it off, then absolutely you should do it. It's it's so good. My, my husband is actually wearing pink today and I commented that he can totally pull it off. So I think for a guy to wear pink, I don't know, I think you kind of have to be like a little bit darker complexion person, maybe. If you're a really pasty white guy, pink's not really your color. Neither is yellow. <clears throat> Just saying. Do you still watch cartoons? Against my will sometimes, but yes, because I have four children. <laughs> What's your least favorite movie? Ooh, my least favorite movie. No judging when I tell you guys what it is because I know that there are going to be people who say, What? That was awesome. Um, my least favorite movie of all time. Um, ooh, no, this one would be my least favorite of all time. So bad I couldn't even finish watching it was Schindler's List. When I was in high school, my English teacher tried to make us um, watch it in the theater, and I left because I couldn't watch it. I said, nope, sorry. And let's see. Where would you bury hidden treasure if you had some? I don't know for sure that I would bury it because I would for sure forget where I buried it. So... I don't know. I'm never going to have treasure, so whatever. What do you what do you drink with dinner? Um, okay, usually I just drink water because I don't drink sodas a whole lot anymore. Um, sometimes I'll drink tea if I'm just wanting something other than water. Um, but more often than not, if we're going out to a nice dinner, then I'll have a glass of wine. What do you dip a chicken nugget in? Ketchup, barbecue sauce, Chick-fil-A sauce is really, really good. Oh, yum. Um, what is your favorite food? Cheese. Cheese is my absolute favorite food, like, of all time, I think. That and bread. I talked about that in my random, random facts about me. What movies could you watch over and over and still love? Um, probably... I'm not, I don't know, I can't give give you like an exact title, um, but I love Dirty Dancing. I watched it over and over and over and over when I was a teenage girl, and it's still one of those that if it's on, I'm just like, I'm glued to the TV. I love it. Last person you kissed and kissed you? Other than my kids, that would be my husband. And, you know, that's pretty good. Were you ever a boy or a girl scout? No, I was not. Would you ever strip or pose nude in a magazine? No, I would not. <laughs> when was the last time you wrote a letter to someone on paper? I wrote a birthday card recently. Does that count? A couple weeks ago, I wrote a birthday card. That's probably the closest to a letter that I've written in quite a while. Can you change the oil on a car? Yes, I can. Ever gotten a speeding ticket? More than I would care to admit. But not recently. Not in a long time. <laughs> Ever ran out of gas? Yes, and it sucks. Favorite kind of sandwich? Hmm. Okay, I was in Walmart with my husband the other day, and this was totally random, but I had this craving for a sandwich that I used to get at Bennigan's, which is no longer even open and hasn't been for probably 100 years. But they had a turkey and Swiss sandwich that was on a pretzel roll. It was so good. It, that was probably the best sandwich I've ever had in my entire life. I need to figure out how to make that. Best thing to eat for breakfast. Hmm. If I didn't have to make it, I would say waffles. I love waffles. Best thing. What is your usual bedtime? I try to be in bed by 10 o'clock. That doesn't always happen, but I try. And then I will usually read or fall asleep. I try to be asleep by 11. I need to move that forward a little bit. Are you lazy? Quite honestly, some days I want to be lazy, but my life doesn't really allow for that because I'm also very um, particular about the way that my house looks. And um, I know that if I get lazy for too long, it will get out of control fast. When you were a kid, what did you, what did you dress up 
as for Halloween. The one thing that I remember dressing up as was a witch. Oh, and then one time when I was in high school, um, we did a, I was in band, I was a band nerd, and we did a special thing, um, and I dressed up as a, like a 50s sock hop girl. So like I wore a poodle skirt and everything. Um, what is your Chinese astrological sign? I'm a Leo. How many languages can you speak? I can fluently speak English. I speak a little bit of French and I'm pretty good at speaking sarcasm. Do you have any magazine subscriptions? Yes, and I want them to stop coming to my house. I do not pay for magazine subscriptions anymore. Um, I'm waiting for them to run out. Like I have Taste of Home and Food Network and Prevention and I think a couple of others that have finally stopped coming. I, to me, they're just clutter because I don't have time to sit and read them. Okay, which are better, Legos or Lincoln Logs? Legos. A lot more possibilities with Legos. Are you stubborn? The most stubborn person that you will ever meet. This girl right here. Who is better, Leno or Letterman? Don't really care because I don't have the time to watch either one. Ever watch soap operas? No. Are you afraid of heights? A little bit. Yeah, I am a little bit afraid of heights. Do you sing in the car? Absolutely very loudly. Do you sing in the shower? No. I don't know why. I just don't. Do you dance in the car? Oh yes, all the time. I'm like, that's me. Ever used a gun? No. Last time you got a portrait taken by a photographer. Last year we had our family pictures taken. Um, yeah. So last year around, I think it was right before Christmas time. Do you think musicals are cheesy? Not like the old school musicals, like the old, old musicals, but to me, the ones now, well, I don't know. No, I guess not. Some of them can be, but for the most part, they're okay. Is Christmas stressful? Yes, Christmas is so stressful. And yet, it is my favorite time of the year. I love it, but it's really stressful. Ever eat a pierogi? Nope. Favorite type of fruit pie? Apple. Yes, apple. Occupations you wanted to be when you were a kid? I wanted to be a teacher, a kindergarten teacher specifically. And now that I have a kindergartner, I'm wondering if maybe I was insane. Um, I think that's the only thing I ever really wanted to be. For a little while when I was a teenager, I thought I wanted to be a park ranger. See, the camping thing. Do you believe in ghosts? No. Ever have a deja vu feeling? Yes, I think we all have. Do I take a, do you take a vitamin daily? I try, some days I forget. Do you wear slippers? Yes. More so during the, the winter than, the, than any other time. Do you wear a bathrobe? Again, during the winter, yes, but not all the time. What do you wear to bed? Ooh, we're getting a little bit personal here. Um, usually I wear like a cami or a tank top and, and shorts. And during the winter, I'll usually throw on sweats on top of that. But the sweats I usually have to lose during the night at some point because I get hot when I'm sleeping. First concert, the Newsboys. Yeah, Newsboys. After that, I went to see John Mayer several times and Rascal Flatts several times. Walmart, Target, or Kmart? Target. Yes, Target. I don't like Walmart. I go there way too much for someone who doesn't like to like their store. But Target, I love it. Nike or Adidas? I don't have a preference, but the past two or three pair of shoes that I've owned have been Nike, so I'm going to go with Nike. But I really, I really wouldn't care. Cheetos or Fritos? Cheetos, please. Peanuts or sunflower seeds? Peanuts. Ever hear of the group Très Bien? No. Should I? Ever take dance lessons? Yes. I was a dancer in college. Is there a profession you picture your future spouse doing? I have a spouse now. So that question seems kind of dumb. Um, he kind of already has a job. So can you curl your tongue? Is that what that means? I don't think so. That's all, that's all I can do though. Ever want a spelling bee? 
Yep, I'm actually really, really good at spelling. Okay, we're on number 73. I'm trying to hurry. Have you ever cried because you were so happy? I'm a girl, so yeah. Yeah, that has happened. Own any record albums? Do I own any? No. Are there any in my house? Yes, but they do not belong to me. Own a record player? No. Regularly burn incense? No. But I do burn candles and use essential oils. But that's not the one. That was not the same thing. Ever been in love? Yeah. Yep, I'm married. And I was in love a couple times, or, you know, love a couple times before that, too. Who would you like to see in concert? Maroon 5. What was the last concert you saw? Wow, that's embarrassing. John Mayer. It was a long time ago. <laughs> it was a long time ago. Um, hot tea or cold tea? I like both. It depends on what mood I'm in. I like hot tea, like at night before I go to bed, kind of like to soothe me. Um, but I like cold tea too. Like iced tea? I live in Texas. I'm all about the iced tea. Um, tea or coffee? Coffee, coffee. Coffee. Iced coffee today. I'm sorry. We're on 82 and I'm really thirsty. Sugar or snicker... Sugar cookies or snickerdoodle? Snickerdoodle. Yeah, sugar cookies are okay, but I like the cinnamon. <clears throat> Can you swim well? Pretty well. Like, if you threw me out in the middle of the ocean for an extended period of time, I would die, for sure. But I can swim pretty well. Yeah, I can hold my own. Can you hold your breath without holding your nose? Yes. Yes, I can. Are you patient? <sighs> I try. <laughs> I try to be patient. I really do. It's one of those things that you know that you kind of need to work on a little bit. I try. I'm better than I used to be. Try You try having four kids. You have to learn some patience. I'm getting there. DJ or band at a wedding? Both would be pretty cool. I mean, but I will say that I've been to weddings where there were bands and then weddings where there were DJs and the ones with a band, those are, those are more fun. Cause like there's a band that you can interact with and they can like interact with the crowd and that's just fun. Okay. Ever won a contest? Yes. When I was little, I was, mm, I would say I was five or younger. I won a beauty pageant. Um, and then when I was in college, yeah, when I was on, when I was a dancer in college, I won a dance competition. Um, ever had plastic surgery? No, not yet. Maybe one day? Hmm. Which are better, black or green olives? Gross, neither, no thank you. Can you knit or crochet? I can crochet, or at least I could once upon a time. I would have to probably refresh my memory. Best room for a fireplace? The living room? Bedroom wouldn't be bad. That'd be pretty, that'd be pretty awesome. Do you want to get married? Yes, I am married. If you are married, how long have you been married? I have been married for three years. Yes, I've been married for three years. Who was your high school crush? I am not going to tell you who my high school crush was because I would be wildly embarrassed if that person ever found out. And I do still have this person in my life, so I'm not going to say that, but I did have a high school crush. Do you cry and throw a fit until you get your own way? No, but it seems to work for my kids, so maybe I should try it. Do you have kids? See answer above. Yes, I do. Do you want kids? Some days yes and some days no. Just kidding. I love my babies. What's your favorite color? Hmm. My favorite color, honestly, is gray. But, like, my favorite accent colors are coral or, like, the mint slash aqua color. That's kind of my thing right now. And, let's see. Do you miss anyone right now? 
Yes, I do. It does not ask me to elaborate. Um, and for whatever reason, that's only 99 questions. So, hmm. okay. So that's it. I did it in 20 minutes. That's not bad. 100 questions in 20 minutes. Okay, guys. So there are 99 more random facts about me that you may or may not have wanted to know. But it was fun to share with you guys. Um, thank you so much for watching and thank you for subscribing to my channel. I can't believe that it has grown as much as it has in the past, you know, month to two months. It's just crazy to me and I'm so excited to see this community continue to grow and just to see, you know, where it'll go from here. So, um, yeah, leave me a comment below and share something really random about yourself so that I can get to know you guys a little bit as well. And that's going to be it. I will talk to you guys very soon, and I love you all. Thank you for watching. Bye.